flip, so I don't need to add another front sight onto the gun. They can just simply flip. I can do the same for the rear sight, but we'll just keep them up for now. Next, we have a trigger that is not stamped to the top this time around. It actually is a working trigger. It has a spring in the back. We have a magazine and a release. You can tell I kind of rushed this magazine. I actually added like layer and layers of cardboard rather than just make a whole new magazine. But it looks fine and it works. So, and the magazine release. Yeah, the magazine is locked until I hit the release. We also have a charging handle. It is not ambidextrous. In real life, it is ambidextrous, but I didn't have enough time to. Well, I did. I just didn't want to. Plus, I got a lot of right-handed guns. I got a lot of guns that have a little right-handed charging handle, so what's wrong with the left hand charging handle this time around? And also, we have a stock, which, although it doesn't fold to the side, it can extend like so so a cool fact this is actually my second scar h um, the first scar h i made was i never really showed i never showed it on the channel but i did make it this is my second scar, and a lot of the pieces from the first scar I brought to the second, such as the barrel, the front sight, the charging handle, some of the attachment reels, and the magazine release, the trigger, and some pieces of the stock. So the only reason why I remade this, this scar each was because the first one was just breaking apart. And it wasn't really as detailed as this one here. So that's why I made a second scar. So, that being said, let's go ahead and just show some attachments. Um, the starters I have a suppressor. If I can get it on. And it's about as bad good as I can get it on. To the gun. Yeah. I, I guess, I don't know, what to really make it a suppressor. But anyway, I'm not, I'm not really a fan of suppressors anyway, so. But I do have a foregrip. That will work. Oh, add that to the gun. Almost like it was in my buffer too. Okay, we also have a top reel. So, can fold these. Yeah, this holographic. Like that. And if you don't really like the holographic, obviously we got this 4X go. So we're gonna put that on too. Alright. So 
So we look through the scope. is the scar H. <laughs> Honestly, this is one of the coolest rifles I've made. It's one of the only few non m weapons that I have in the armory, and that's saying a lot. I have quite a few M4s. But it's this is just one of them that happens to not be an M4. So that's cool. But yeah, tell me what you think. You know, if you like this prop, if you like the video, you know, be sure to leave a thumbs up on this video. If you have any comments or suggestions for about this gun or any other future guns um, in the future, be sure to comment that down below in the comment section below um subscribe if you are new to the channel and if you're enjoying the content on this channel i will be building not just guns but i'll also build other stuff too like a sword or anything else for that matter or i would try my best to do that and also turn on post notifications when you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss no, so you don't miss when I upload. And be sure you check out my Instagram channel, my Instagram page, where I post artwork on there occasionally. And this, that'll be all for this video. This is JV signing off. And until next time, guys. Peace out.